Uh, Harry, we saw top of the game, one of the, the biggest horses I'd imagine down at, down at Ditchid and, and chasing very much the aim for him this season. Yeah, it was slightly unfortunate what happened first time out last year, um, but he's always going to be a chaser, hopefully with his size. He jumped well this morning, so full steam ahead. What's the plan for him? I'd imagine something in a couple of weeks' time. Um, you'd like to think he'll get to the RSA. And we, we, he was working with a horse called Chamron? Yeah, Chamron. Um, it's a nice horse. He won twice two listed races in France. We haven't seen him much over here. Um, he was going to run really nicely at Chepstow when he fell at three out. So we just brought him here for a bit of a confidence booster. And of course, all systems go for the Ladbrokes Trophy. Black Court in the stables, possible runner in the big race. Yeah, he ran well in the Charlie Hall. Um, well, he, he ran well here last season, um, getting beat by Elegant Escape. Um, it's a rock solid horse. He stays well, jumps well, um, so hopefully he'd run well. I mean, he had a fantastic novice season last year. Paul, a few times through the season, felt he might struggle to, to replicate that in, in his second season chasing. Mark is on at the moment. Do you think that's you know a hard enough task in a race like the Ladbrokes Trophy? For sure. Um, you know, I think the last race at Weatherby kind of showed where we were with him. Um, so it will be tough for him. Having said that, he's quite a consistent horse. He always runs his race, so you'd like to think he'd do the same again.